spending long hours in any water-based activity such as in the bath or in the swimming pool, you must have noticed cracked up lines or wrinkles appear on your fingers. While it looks a little funny, it also makes about the reason behind it. These wrinkled fingers are scientifically known as pruny fingers. The science behind the occurrence of pruny fingers is not that hard to understand. Our skin has a natural layer of lubricant called sebum oil which maintains and protects the natural moisture of our skin making it waterproof. That is why when you wash your hands and feet or take a bath, water does not get absorbed in your skin. It washes away. But when you spend prolonged time in water, the sebum oil gets washed off, allowing water to penetrate inside the skin. Just below the layer of the skin, a lot of blood vessels are present which help in sending messages to the brain from the fingers. When the water starts soaking in the skin, a message is sent through the nervous system telling those blood vessels to shrink. This process is called vasoconstriction. Due to the shrinking of the blood vessels, the volume of blood also gets reduced making the veins, arteries and capillaries thinner. The skin ultimately dampens causing wrinkles on our fingers. Now that you know the science behind our pruny fingers, do you think there could be a purpose of those wrinkles? A few scientists conducted an experiment to understand whether these temporary wrinkly fingers actually have a role to play in the evolutionary path of human beings. They took a few marble pieces and picked it up first with dry fingers and then with pruny fingers to observe any changes in their grip of the marble pieces. Guess what? Pruny fingers provided better grip than dry fingers. This is similar to using a pen with a rubber grip and another without one. The one without a grip will keep slipping out of your fingers while the one with a tight grip would hold your fingers in place. Research is still being conducted in this area to prove this theory of pruny fingers being an evolutionary advantage. But till then, why don't you conduct your own experiments and try holding different kinds of things with your funny wrinkly fingers?